What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33. I get messages from the Divine, I give them straight to you guys. So clearing out any energy that will not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current energy for the collective. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Welcome all my supporters. I appreciate you guys for liking and commenting and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate all of the love, the support, the donations, the bookings, the emails. I appreciate you guys for all of the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate y'all. All right, for real. I appreciate you. All right, y'all. So let's get into it. See what's up. Got the messages. What are the messages? All right. So something's going on with someone's journey. Okay. Something about somebody taking a train somewhere or something like that. Pathway wanted to come out. And then we got judgment. Okay, this is giving me an energy y'all i ain't gonna lie this is giving me an energy of somebody trying to go on a run to try to avoid some kind of um to try to avoid something that's the first vibe i just got off rip i just got that kind of vibe with this also i'm getting somebody could be making a final judgment to move forward somebody could be spending a lot of money on a gift or something like that somebody's spending a lot of money on a gift this wealthy man spending a lot of money on a gift or something like that. That's what I'm seeing. Somebody is. Okay, or some shit. But I'm seeing somebody making a final decision. And whoever this... This could be a wealthy man making a final decision. When it comes to somebody. And this person is about to like give somebody a big ass gift or something. Somebody about to get a big ass motherfucking gift, yo. Something to do with 26, 30, 35, 45. Something with 13 or 17. Somebody can have two children. Something with October 26, October 30th, October 13th, October 17th. Something to do with 35, 30. All right, so let's see. Let's get more into it, Spirit. What's going on? magician for some of y'all this some of you manifested yeah we got lovers here strong uh, gemini energy we got aries too yeah page of wands yeah but this is bad news for somebody else though three of swords okay so this is bad news for somebody else but this is good news for another of course Okay, so we got Libra, Sagittarius, Gemini, Aries. Lovers again. Damn. Emperor. Okay, so there is a um, a wealthy man. Okay, this person could have had a lot of lovers or something like that. But this person is ending shit with a lot of people. Okay, I'm feeling that energy. And it's stressing these people out. <laughs> that, these, that this person is ending shit with. So this could have been somebody that they did have a lot of lovers and options and shit. But this person is like ending it with people. And it, these people are like pissed off. Okay. They are like very upset here. <laughs> they mad as fuck. Okay. What's this magician? Damn. What's this magician? I seen the devil. What's this magician? Empress. Ten of Cups. Three of Swords. <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. <laughs> Damn. Okay, so this is what I just received. The message. With this. What just came out. So, this could have been somebody that tried to manipulate somebody into staying with them. But all it did was make them single. Okay, so this is somebody that tried to manipulate somebody and staying with them. But this person got heartbroken. Because they end up being single. And now this person mad as fuck. Yeah, because somebody is like choosing to partner up with somebody else. 
<laughs> yeah, so somebody tried to do some kind of manipulation, but they heartbroken because it didn't work. Okay. <laughs> yep. What's this lovers? What's this lovers? What's his lovers? Mm-hmm. Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Cups. I'm telling you. Somebody is looking back on, on these lovers that they was fucking with. And they just walking away from their ass. Like, I'm out. And it's shocking them. And it's causing a lot of anger and shit. Yeah, because it's like, not only is this person emotionally walking away, this person is totally ending it. And it's causing all this fucking chaos because all this magic and manipulation that somebody was hell bent on working on over time and shit, now it's backfiring. Okay, so all this manipulation that somebody was getting into is backfiring now. Okay, so whatever manipulation somebody was doing, it didn't work, it's backfiring. It's not turning out how someone expected things to turn out in the situation. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not. Yeah, somebody thought they was going to be able to connect some shit, and it's not connecting. Okay? So this could have been some kind of, like, manipulation that someone had did, and they was, like, happy that something was going to turn out in their favor. But this person is about to, either they're about to be heartbroken, or this person is heartbroken right now. Yep. Somebody thought they was top dog or some shit. Okay? <laughs> page of wands what's this page of wands what's this page of wands yep high priestess yeah you already for some of you guys you your intuition is already telling you something about this situation yeah yep I, <laughs> this is so funny because this is giving me an energy where it's like I'm hearing like who who all these lovers are. They're like, like they're trying to compare themselves to someone here. Like all these lovers, it's like they're trying to compare themselves to someone that someone is choosing to uh, be with or something. What's this three of swords? What's this three of swords? So these lovers are trying to. <laughs> This is crazy. These lovers are trying to like copy ways that somebody is choosing. So let's say like this wealthy man, right? He got all these lovers and shit. But the person that they choosing is like uh, somebody spiritual. Like it's an opposite of these lovers and shit. So these lovers is looking at this person that someone is choosing and they're trying to embody that energy the same energy but it's not working though <laughs> five of ones it's like somebody they're trying to embody an energy that is not originally theirs and whoever this man is this man know that this man know that all these holes is just fake and they just trying to mock somebody energy that they're not okay is what i just heard what's this three of swords What's this three of swords? Okay, that was the moon card in the reverse, though, because all this hit and shit is out now. <laughs> because if you are spiritual, for some of you guys, you could be very in tune. You don't have to be a reader, but you could just be very in tune. You know your shit. You know what the fuck you be saying. Things that you say come true and shit. And it's like, for some of y'all, it's like, for some of y'all, if you are a reader, this person watches you and it's like, they get information about all these people around them and they just be cutting motherfuckers off and shit. And that's why these people is mad because it's like, it's like this, whoever this wealthy man is, this person really like value what you say. Okay. So they just... It's like they be listening to you and then for some of y'all, the ones, because there are readers on here that, you know, they're very detailed and stuff like that. 
and it's like you will say a name or some shit okay and this <laughs> they be like this imp this whoever this man is be like oh okay okay i gotta cut that motherfucker off too all right like and then these people be looking at you like man like for some of y'all, you really don't know like how much <laughs> influence you have over with this situation. Like for real, like somebody like there's like a wealthy person that really values what you say. Like when it comes to motherfuckers and situations for some of y'all, this could be a wealthy man that come visit you at your job. You know what I'm saying? And this wealthy man always be coming to you, talking to you. For some of y'all, you may not even know this person is wealthy like they are. And they come up to your job and they be talking to you and shit. And you just be giving them advice or you be giving them things to do or some shit. And this person about to give you a big ass gift or something. Like a thank you gift or something. Or they may give you like a check or some money or something. Because this person look at you as like a gift. Like you really helped them through a situation. This wealthy man here, possibly when it did come to a lover situation, you was talking to this wealthy man about a lover situation. If this is a wealthy man that has came to your job or something like that, you was talking to this person about a lover situation and you've been giving this person tips and on what they should, you know what I'm saying? Just like throwing things out there, you know, really, you know, this person may have really opened up to you about their situation that they were going through. Or just situations, period. And it's like, this person really value what you say. You know what I'm saying? They like, oh, yeah, I'm going to try that or I'm going to do that. You know, that type of shit. What's this, lovers? What's this, lovers? Nine of pentacles in the reverse. Damn. Strength card. So, all of these lovers that this wealthy man is cutting off, these lovers... This wealthy man was supporting them financially. This wealthy man was helping them a lot financially. And now since this wealthy man is kind of like looking at you and kind of like really got their eye on you and want to do something for you or you have their attention. These lovers, it's like they not getting the attention that they were getting from this wealthy man at first. It may be even money too. You know what I'm saying? Like they're they're not getting what they used to get. Yep. So it's like for some of y'all, this could be your mate that always be cheating and shit with different lovers. But this person is backing up from these lovers, and these lovers is mad as fuck. They are mad as hell. So for some of y'all, your intuition is right. Okay. Like this person did have a lot of lovers, or yeah, but this person is like. These lovers is getting heartbroken because it's like they backing up from doing shit, you know, like for them or whatever that they were doing. Okay. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah. I spent the deck in November. So something really specific about November could be significant for this. So the signs, we got very strong Gemini. We got Libra, Sagittarius, Pisces, Taurus, Cancer, Virgo, Scorpio, Leo. Okay. Only take a resonate and leave the rest for your situation. All right. So something within two weeks in this situation possibly by january so between within two weeks and january for some of you guys it could have something to do with two weeks in january okay so something about this situation from now into january okay will be taking place in the situation so that's what i'm seeing y'all something to do with a college graduate that's what I'm seeing. Scorpio. Somebody can have five kids or less. Yeah, because journey is someone going in another direction. You know, somebody is like, they're going another direction. So, that's what I'm seeing here. 
Somebody spent a lot of money on a gift, though. I'm seeing that for real. Mm -hmm. Or a nice piece of change on a gift. All right, something with left arm tattoos. collective current energy for the collective all right bottom of the deck we have back tattoos somebody could love wearing jeans all the time we have stripper aquarius wine x kind Somebody could love wearing sunglasses or have a sunglass line. We have sedan, workaholic, factory worker, janitor or housekeeper, 80s, X. Somebody could love Starbucks or they coffee, period. <laughs> In the morning, definitely. Something to do with Aquarius. Somebody could have a two-year-old. We have G. We have Hood. Condo. Somebody could love wearing baseball caps, socks with flip flops, long eyelashes, real or fake, smoke cigars. Yeah, I'm telling y'all some real ass shit about this. Middle class. We have O. Dark liquor. Beer. Five five and below. Durag. We have S. Something to do with a Capricorn. Somebody could have been born in December. We have gap teeth. Okay. Something about December could be significant. Somebody could have been born on the 12th of the month. Okay. Something with Sangria. Something to do with Samantha. Something to do with Samuel. All right. Let's get an oracle. I heard Orlando. I heard Orleans. Something to do with Orleans. New Orleans. Give me an oracle spirit for this. Give me an oracle. Something with a boxer. Something with wrestling. Somebody could be a professional wrestler. I just heard. Okay. I heard Shanita. I heard Onisha. Something about a ballerina. Okay. I heard pageant, pageant. Someone could have been in a pageant. Something about 2012, 2012. Yeah, definitely good luck. Hell yeah, metamorphosis. So this is giving me energy of a whole situation turning in someone's favor. That's what I'm seeing. Hell yeah. Then we got relationships. So, for some of you guys, this is a situation that's going through a metamorphosis. Or this could be your love life going through a metamorphosis. <laughs> for some of you guys, whether you, yeah. Metam it's going in a good way, though. This is a good way. So, yeah. Something with Cox. C-O-X. All right. Wow. So this could have been somebody like somebody did try to hold something back, but this person is disappointed because all it did you now you're getting what you want times 10. Okay? Cause somebody thought that they was able to <laughs> 
take something, you know, or whatever. So, no. I'm hearing for some of y'all, this this wealthy man found out a secret that a lover was um holding. And for some of y'all, you helped this person discover a secret that somebody was holding back. You helped this person discover that. Okay, is what I'm seeing. Little do you know, maybe you don't know that you did this, but you did. You helped reveal a secret that helped this person in their situation. Yep. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, look at that. Right when I split, split this deck here, it's like love here. That's crazy. Yep, and you got thrown. Damn. Period. Hell yeah, so that's what I'm seeing, y'all. You help somebody figure out who someone really was or some shit. Yeah. You help somebody realize that someone was just manipulating them and that they should walk away from them or some shit. Or for some of y'all, you could have warned someone that someone was going to disappoint them or something. Okay, or something like that. And this could have been a person that's a very good manipulator, but you helped this person realize that they were dealing with, you know, a snake energy, like like a person that's like very sneaky. I'm going to just say that. Like a person that's like very sneaky, conniving, like two-faced kind of vibes. Okay, so you help someone realize that about someone. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. Or this is what's coming up. All right, you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace and love.